Hey, good morning. It's Rosalie with Can't Wait to Plan. And today, it's going to be a very first time for me to do a happy mail from my friend Karen. Um, we actually met on YouTube uh, last year and became fast friends. We found that we have so many things in common. And um, we both are paper hoarders. <laughs> so um, we decided to compare notes a little bit and um, swap some stuff that maybe we have plenty of and would like to share or things that we already use once and is now sick of it and want to uh, turn it over to someone who is also very much in love with with these type of thing and um, that can use them and give it new life. So in any case, I sent Karen um, a swap package, a Happy Mail package recently, and um, I just received hers. Now, first, the reason I didn't open it yet is I wanted to show you what we figure out, um, what Karen figure out and share with me. So I did mine the same way. Um, we love these medium flat rate box, the one that's um, kind of 12 by 14. It's if you leave the box, they open the flap of it on this on the side. Um, but if you leave the box intact and try to shove your um, 12 by 12 paper in them, I felt like we felt like it's just a little tight. So because, you know, you want to protect it with some um, classy 12 by 12 uh, packaging on the outside. Just you know, just the one that you get when you buy a, a, a scrapbook kit or something like that. And um, so she came up with this brilliant idea to cut it. Um, let's see where she cut it at. So she cut it um, somewhere. I don't see it here. Maybe this one she didn't cut it. Yeah, she did. See, she cut it right here. I don't know if you can see it. And then she, th that flap opened up and you can pack everything, you know, and we, we, I didn't even bother closing mine. I closed one end and then um, you pack everything from the top down. And that way, when you, when you, um, what do you call it? Uh, finish packaging and make sure it's, it's flat. When you put it back on, you don't have to pack it super tidy like that either you can leave a small gap just make sure all of your paper inside is protected and everything else because everything um, we send each other we put it in the bag separately too so you know in case the box rip or something like that or when you taped it over um, to reseal it back on you don't um, you don't hit any of your paper by mistake with the shipping tape but I um, I think she got in 12 pounds on this now these medium flat rate box ship anywhere in the U.S. I think except Alaska and, and Hawaii for um, uh, 1375 which is you have to do that on paypal shipping or pirate ship or or um you know online or something usps online but not when you take it to the post office the post office charge you a little bit more because they have to help you in person so we did that actually i just did paypal ship 1375 I put a little note in my post um, in my mailbox for my postman to knock on my door when he comes to pick up our mail or deliver our mail, and he just knock on the door and I hand it to him. I don't even have to go to the drop it off at the post office. It was so awesome. Um, but anyway, on in mine, I was very greedy and I was able to get in seventeen pounds, no eighteen pounds in mine, and it still shipped for thirteen seventy five. Um, so it was awesome. Um, so anyway, I'm going to pause the video now and um, open this up and pull everything out. I'm so excited. This is my first Happy Meal ever. Um, all right, talk to you real soon. Okay, I finished unpacking everything and look, my God, look what I got. I can't wait. She got me a, she made me a card and pink is my favorite color. So this is what she said. It's be good, be the good and dream. Oh my gosh, so pretty. Look at all these glitter paper thingy. It looks like she made it with napkins or something. Karen with Yes Please Paper Craft has a beautiful um, um, video showing you how to use saran wrap and um, and uh, beautiful napkin to make into scrapbook paper. It gives you a lot of texture and things, but I'm not sure what that is, but it's really pretty. And I love butterfly. That's why she put butterfly everywhere. She said, um, I didn't check with her if I can read it, but uh, 
Anyway, I will. <laughs> Rosalie, once in a while you find a friend and it feels like you've known each other forever. I truly enjoy talking to you. It seems we could talk forever and never run out of things to talk about. I feel like I've found a kindred spirit. Thanks so much for being my friend. Hugs. Oh, love, love, love. Thank you so much, Karen. I love you too, babe, my girl. Um, okay, so before I go into our swap, I did, um, I don't have a very good Tuesday morning close to me. Um, all the one, it seems like I had three Tuesday mornings super close to my house. One of them is actually quite good and they all closed down. So for me to go to a Tuesday morning now, I have to drive 40 to 50 minutes to get to one. I have two locations, that's about that far away and therefore I don't get to go very often so when I go it seems like they're out of everything I, I never see any of the thing that she show or other people shown on their Tuesday morning haul so um, she called me I, I asked her whenever she sees some stuff that's uh, you know we've exchanged lists of what I don't have a lot of the line that I don't have since I stopped scrapbooking about 14 years ago um, or I took a pause and um, when my kids were little so um, I, I don't know anything about simple stories. I just started collecting again. So she saw the Say, the say Cheese number four um, collection kit with the embellishment stencil. And so she got that for me. I know you guys seen this already. So I'll do a flip through at the end. But this um, this was Tuesday morning for $6.99, $11.99 for the kit with the... Um, sticker sheet but also they put in the you know the chipboard sticker as well as the bits and pieces or their embellishment one of their embellishment kit so it's a it's a actually very good deal and um and then this one is 6.99 it has some other embellishment pack some washi tape and a stencil and i don't have any hardly any stencil so that's a good thing to get and i also love I do love some summer farmhouse. I've seen, I've been on Simple Story website to take a look and things like that. So she got me a large collection kit as well. It goes with, she is so sweet. Um, the uh, sticker sheet, but it also come with some brats and the stencil, six by six stencil. Then she found this hip hip hooray. Um, I love enamel dots, even though I've started to play with, um, you know, Nouveau Drops and some of the other stuff. I just got a, um, um, the, the big deal that uh, scrapbook.com uh, showcased a couple of days ago where you can get this like nice, all the various colors of their pop of colors, which is basically a supposedly a better nouveau drop to make enamel dots and so i bought that um for twenty dollars that was really good um <clears throat> anyway enamel dots some washi tape i don't know if these really come with the kit or not and then the brad from the i am collection which i'm also collecting so that was good 6.99 for that too so i'll put that through in a little bit and then um just before <clears throat> she melted out I text her some pictures of some new, <clears throat> what do you call it, sticker sheet that I found at Tuesday morning. And she didn't have a few of those, so I picked her up some. And then she texted me back, and she said, I have some extra of these. And um, at my last Tuesday morning, whenever I went, do you have these? And I don't. I love them. I've never even seen them. And I love butterflies so much. And I love floral so much. So these are gorgeous. Really, really pretty. So I can't wait. Um, she, Karen told me um, or let me know about many of the the manufacturers that have popped up since she actually only started scrapbooking since 2017 or something like that. But um, it's a lot sooner than when I you know, when I started again, which is this year. So um, I've never heard of Bella Boulevard or anything like that. And she had some extra. This is the Addison collection. Um, oh my gosh, she sent me a lot of Addison collection, which is wonderful. This is the six by eight. I love this. All these colors are so nice, so easy to use. Can't wait. And then the um, uh, Mind Your Manners collection. Look at these owls. Oh, so cute and look at oh my gosh i love that these these collections are have such beautiful bright and um bright colors which i love 
And then they're also, in case you don't know, they're double-sided as well. And the back is all solid color. So if you need something to complement the paper perfectly, that's like awesome. Okay, thank you so much, sweetheart. That's beautiful. Um, and, oh my goodness, this is a Life is Perfect from Simple Story sticker. And I don't have this collection at all. So this will be a start of my collection for um, Life is Perfect. Um, I love Simple Story, so this is like wonderful. Actually, I'm gonna do this real quick. It, oh my gosh, I don't know. These are cute little charm. Oh my goodness, there's like, I love charm. I don't use them as much. Be, I haven't been using them as much. I have quite a few of them too, but these I don't have at all. These is a little um, lock and lock with a little key thingy. This is a beautiful cross. Oh, the fleur de lis, I love that. And let's see what else. We got um, all these little fishy seahorses and so on. Oh, that's the key for the lock. And um, some angel wings, I love that. Some angels, I don't know if you can even see it because they're tiny, but they're actually a good size. Oh, I like that, look at this. You see it? It's like a little, um, it looks like a little sewing machine. How cute is that? And then the various thing. Oh, there's a fan. Oh my gosh, it's like so cute. I have to find ways to even use it on my scrapbook page instead of just as charms. Look how cute is that? All right, and then this one is bunch of different hearts related um, charms and the um, some more owls and different animals oh yeah cats and so on oh I love it awesome my girl okay so then um, I think this oh and uh, she also she saw this on sale on one of the um, scrapbook site online site that she shopped at and she knew I love Bow Bunny and Heidi Swap, so she picked up for me the noteworthy uh, embellishment, which I can use with anything. This goes well with, I believe, the Heirloom Collection. Yeah, this is the Heirloom Collection, which she did ask me, and I said, yep, get it. And then this is the, I think it's the Botanical Collection, which I also absolutely love. So I can't wait to see that. Um, and then this is us, uh, I mean, um, Heidi Swap. And I don't know which collection this is. She told, oh, uh, Honey and Spice. Oh, I just got a Honey and Spice um, paper pack from um, from Hobby Lobby recently. I've never even seen or heard of that uh, brand or the, the that collection. So that's wonderful. And I can do a quick layout of the thing at the end for you if you're interested um, to see. Okay, so let's take a quick look at, at um, oh my gosh, she sent me some cocoa vanilla. She, um, I don't know if you heard of Coco Vanilla. It's actually a company out of Australia. And um, last year, when they had their big sales at the, I think, Black Friday or something like that, um, Karen took the money she made from um, Rakuten, which she shared with me, and it, it's wonderful. It's like you, you can shop online and just make sure you sign up for it. And then basically they give you a rebate. So she got uh, several hundred dollars, I think $100, $150. So she splurged and bought it from them. It costs a little bit more to ship. And I do know there's a couple of websites that um, sell this, but it's expensive. And this was such a good deal. And so she got some. And when she did her, her, um, her videos for her haul for that, I was just, I fell in love and I told her, oh my God, I love this paper. This is from the Happiness Collection. Oh my gosh, so beautiful. Thank you so much, sweetheart. I'll do a quick flip through so you can marvel on how gorgeous these paper are and how jealous you are that I have such a good friend that's willing to share these, I mean, oh my Lord. It's gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I can't stand it. Look how cute is that. And these are the boys collection, boys rule. You can tell it's very boyish, but look how pretty. These are such pretty paper. And this is midnight. 
and I think it's about, yeah, it's about stars and things. Look at how gorgeous these ombre paper are. My goodness, I can't stand it. Oh, oh my God, look at these flowers. Oh, how can you put anything on this? It's like so pretty to cover up. One of a kind, this is more than words. And, oh, I can't stand that. Thank you so much, baby. I know that um, these are precious to you, and I so appreciate you sharing it with me. And Joanne Bartel, if you're not using what Karen sent you on Cocoa Vanilla since you already have it, send them to me. <laughs> All right. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> she was in such a rush. We, we've been working on this swap for a long time, both of us. And um, so she was hurrying up because she had guests coming over one night last week. And so she was trying to hurry up to get all these packed. And she even left her paper because I kind of share with her what I liked and don't like on some of the videos she did. And um, she's, she forgot these in there. That's so cute. Okay. Oh, my goodness. She got... She got this paper pad from um, Tuesday morning. It's such a good deal. I mean, I tell you, I never see any 49 market or anything like that again. I just started collecting them because, again, they're brand new for me. But this is beautiful, um, beautiful, beautiful paper. And if you've never seen them, let me do a quick flip through. This, I think, has retired, but you can still find them. It, it I can't even say that word. Oh, my God. Look how pretty. They come in um, 8x8 as well as 12x12. 12 12. See, these we can use because we can at least put stuff, the places to put stuff on the back. Look how pretty. Oh, my God. So gorgeous. Oh, shoot. Like, how can you stand this? And the, the, the back side is gorgeous, too. I mean, it's like, which side do you use? Oh, these cut apart are gorgeous. And these cut apart. Oh my God, girl, what, what did you keep? I hope they, they came with two sheet each. Some of these company only come with one sheet each. So, okay, this is the larger size of that paper. I think we saw something similar in the eight and a half, uh, eight by eight. Oh, I love this so much. I have not gotten this yet. So um, I can't wait to play with them and yep i uh, with all this crap i got i gotta start doing something with them instead of just hoarding them and collecting them and organizing them right oh my gosh i love this collection i was telling karen that i saw somebody's haul that um they were flipping through i think even karen did too um the bobany faith collection but i saw it first on somebody else's channel i don't remember who and I just fell in love with it. I tried to find it. I couldn't find it anymore. It's a little bit older collection. I'm not sure from what year, but it's called Faith. And it has these beautiful colors in them. And um, so, Karen, I don't know if you printed this out yourself, but this is so beautiful. All I did when I did for her is I just put a little label. <laughs> so, oh my gosh, be the light. I love coral. This is my favorite one of my favorite colors to wear as a lipstick, corally pink. Um, this is not corally pink, but I love coral. And I like that it's single-sided. You know, this is a paper pad, so I, that, that way we don't have to choose. Make life much easier. Oh, my Lord. These, these glitter um, embellishment or accent is gorgeous. I love hearts, too, and so does Karen. And this, is, this page is absolutely amazing. Oh, <gasps> so pretty i love this page so much it's like it's a little busy but i don't care i don't care love 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 pink rose whatever love it all oh my gosh look at this gorgeous girl pondering dreaming butterflying oh uh, i'm impartial to polka dots any kind, any size, any color. I love them. This is gorgeous with the angel wings there. This, oh, 
the coloring in this collection is so gorgeous. Any of you who's watching, I know it's a new channel, so no, nobody's really watching <laughs> my channel since I just started last week. But any of you who's watching and know someone who have some of these Faith Collection from Bow Bunny that want to get rid of, I will even buy them. Doesn't have to be a swap. Ah, uh, beautiful. And these cut apart is so pretty. And the, ah, uh, and there's that beautiful girl again. She's so gorgeous. Her face so symmetrical. My face all not symmetrical. Um, balloons, air, hot air balloons. Oh, that's, see, this is a beautiful shade of apple green. That's that's I don't normally love green, especially like emerald color, the deeper one, but the lighter one just make me so happy. Here's some beautiful roses for Rosalie on coral, my favorite, one of my favorite color beside pink, blush pink. This is great. Cut up you can cut these apart, you can use it as a whole or use it as part of it. See this is these these things are great to keep. Okay, you guys all know this, but I'm just preaching to the part to the to the what do you call it preaching to the choir there there you can cut them out you can use them as strips to to layer and make a cluster to do um, page titles um, or page embellishment believe oh yeah she cut these off of that by mistake oh I see gorgeous oh these cut apart are wonderful even if i don't have embellishment those make great embellishment look at this beautiful coral paper oh my gosh i love it i hope they sent you two of everything um which it seems like they did but thank you so much for sharing them with me i absolutely love it so this is i've never heard of this company um and i i told I mentioned to Karen because when she sent me the list of what she has, she is so organized. I tell you, if you haven't checked out her craft organization playlist on her YouTube channel, Yes, Please Pick Up Craft, I'll, I'll link it below in the description so you can see it too. She's so organized. Um, so when I saw that, I said, I've never heard of that company, Craft Consortium. Consortium, I think <laughs> that's how you say it. Um, it is beautiful people oh my gosh this is like a it's it's not the super thick cardstock but it's like this one is gold shimmery <gasps> oh my lord that's gorgeous so see oh gosh she sent me two of each that's wonderful this one got this is the, the this collection is all about bees oh wow love it one of the girls i watch her youtube channel sometime she is obsessed about bees and i don't remember who it was but i otherwise i would go tell her about this collection that she can get oh look how pretty this is um oh my goodness lovely lovely look at that this is uh, so easy to use, you know. I mean, it's it's busy, but it's so monotone that um, it's great to do. Beautiful, beautiful paper. I love the texture of this too. It's very smooth, but it's very very nice. I believe it's a company from England. Gorgeous, and look look at the. You know, it looks like they put a little bit of glossy accent on the bees, so they kind of stand out. Thank you so, so much, sweetheart, for sharing that with me. Um, and this is the same company, Craft Consortium. Actually, maybe this was not Craft Consortium. Maybe it's Hackney and Company. I thought it was Craft. Oh, yeah, it is. It's Craft Consortium right there. Um, this one is called Over the Hedge. Sorry about that. Oh my gosh, she sent me Gilded Grey. I saw her do a flip through of this on one of her hauls and I'm like, I absolutely loved it. And I looked everywhere. Um, Joanne Michaels and stuff, I couldn't find anything. Oh, look at these cute hedgehogs and so on. This is called um, Over the Hedge. And again, the texture is beautiful. Look at all of these forest friends, the little cutesy hedgehog this beautiful paper and back oh my gosh the owls and the fox oh god so cute 
Do you see it? I'm in frame. I feel like I'm out of frame. Okay. Um, oh, that's nice too. Oh my God, what do I do? These beautiful mushrooms. Beautiful paper. Oh, wow. That's beautiful, colorful. This one goes into falls a little bit. Folly color. Oh, look at the, the owl. The owl scare me a little bit, you know, in terms of as an animal. But when you make them cutesy like this, how can you stand it? Cute little pine cones. Very dark paper. Great to use as background for anything. These bursts of things. Love, 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 love. Thank you so much, baby girl. Okay, Gilded Gray. Now, I know die cut with a view. They usually only give you two sheets each, but Karen told me that she typically only does one page layout, whereas I do mostly two page layout. So that's why she usually can afford to share. But I'm like, ah, oh, that's like so, oh my God. <laughs> I'm going to die and gone to heaven. Look how gorgeous this is. I'm like, right? Uh, uh, uh. And it's single-sided. Yes. Awesome. Gorgeous rings on a blush, pink, peach, whatever color. Beautiful. Beautiful. Look at that. It's just so simple to use, too. I mean, these are just... Gorgeous for background. So simple. I love this honeycomb pattern with a little bit of gold foil. These rings are just pretty. You know, you can even use this in like a wedding album thing because it's it's rings. You know, no never ending. This kind of chevron Aztec design is super cute. Or manly. It's actually very manly too. I mean, some of these papers, the, the one that's peach is feminine but some of the other one can really be used in an in a boys or men album i'm working on a um a gift album for my husband's 70th and it's not for a few years yet but it's gonna be a long project so i probably will get started soon this i absolutely love 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 the gray see how how masculine this is it can be very masculine or very feminine so it depends, but I like that. I love this paper again, but now in a lighter color. Absolutely love it. Love, love. And there you go in the very masculine pattern. And these are those leaves again in, in, in on a gray background. My polka dots, love. Very, very pretty. And these cut apart are just super awesome. Oh gosh, these are like the best ever be bold. I would cut these apart and use them as little sentiment on embellishment that you make or something like that. Thank you so much, sweetheart. I cannot believe you share half of the paper pack <laughs> with me on this. You are so generous. Oh gosh, I've never even heard of Hip Kit Club. And I think um, Karen used to belong to them. They, she, I think she stopped this year in 2021, but she had the subscription for a long time. And when I told her I've never heard of them, um, she's sending me some. This is from May 2020. Look how pretty. Oh, wow. And the paper is really thick too. Yeah, I've never heard of them. I've really, oh, this is nice. I like that. Very bold. This is so easy to use. And look how pretty that is these flowers gorgeous this is neat can you see the 010203 very pretty oh okay now which side am i going to use i have to use this side so pretty the ultimate stencil guide very nice very nice thank you so much and um so on <laughs> i saw somebody else um, flipped through this from a long time ago. This is an old, old pad. And I went on Etsy. I went on eBay. I've looked everywhere. Nobody has it. It's from Michael's. Um, I think this was the one. And I couldn't find it. I was so depressed. And then when I got Karen lists of the stuff she owned, she actually had this on there. I never even thought of asking her. But 
look at this. You'll see why I love it so much um, and was going nuts trying to find it. The, the roses is just absolutely gorgeous. Look. Oh, God. So pretty. So pretty on the mint green paper. Some collage in a very muted tone on tone. So usable, so pretty. They have things that are bright but pastel y, and then some that's just muted enough for you to use in whatever way you like. How gorgeous is that? How gorgeous! Can't stand it. Beautiful. Create your own happiness. Oh. Frame that for a while and then I'll take it down to use it later as a, as a, um, God, this is so pretty. And I love roses, you know, and that's not my favorite flower though. I actually, my favorite is magnolia. I love the smell of magnolia. Oh, so beautiful, baby. Thank you so, so much. I'm going to treasure this one. We're going to have to hoard it for a little while before I use it because it's just like so nice. And and then these, I think, are, are going to be just... she. Um, Karen has a group of friends that she scrapbooked with locally um, in Louisiana. And I'm so jealous that I don't have anyone nearby me. I live in Southern California, which I should have plenty of people. But, you know, actually, I don't know that I can really <laughs> scrapbook with others. I'd be so distracted. I'd be like a social butterfly chatting and stuff. I would never get any work done. Um, so she buy these bulk um, 25 sheets or 10 sheets of paper from Tuesday morning. And I seen them. I can never buy them. I don't have anyone to share it with. So um, she, she buy those and they split it between the friends that she has. And she still have some. So she's splitting them with me. And I'm so appreciative. This is gorgeous. I don't know. This is We Are Memory Keeper. And see, she have multiple sheets. Of, oh my gosh, she sent me like five sheets of each. <laughs> That's crazy. These kind of, I love this camera. Oh my Lord, that's so cute. And oh God, look at this paper. I could see why she bought it. Gorgeous. And this one is Amy Tangerine Hustle and Heart. I love to, Amy Tangerine. She always does these things that are very bright, very bold color. These are great cut apart. Gorgeous. And this too. You know, these are great. Just like almost remind me of, uh, remind me of the um, KS Craft from AliExpress or uh, which copy Tim holds, you know, do these tiny little sentiment that you can use on your clusters and so on. And then this one is gorgeous. This like Bo Bunny. Oh, wow. This is amazing. This is Bo Bunny um, collection Life in Color. Oh, look at these frame. Even if I don't like what's in it, I can cover it up and just use it as a as a frame to frame my photos. But look at these cassette tape. That's my time, you know. I used to listen to cassette all the time. And look how pretty this background is. And see why you got a girlfriend. But I like this page super a lot. And then this one is from um, Chamel Sparkle City. I do have a paper pack from here, but I don't remember seeing this page in there. So thank you. These coffee mugs and so on. This one is Girl Sweat. I don't have hardly any pebble. So this will be cool. Very neat chevron pattern there. This is back. Oh, I just saw somebody did a, a flip through on Maggie Home Flourish. She found a paper pad somewhere and I absolutely fell in love with them. Um, and I don't have, I haven't even heard of it. I don't have anything Maggie Home until I started collecting her brand new collection called Garden Party. Um, but I love Flourish based on what I saw in that thing. So thank you. These cut apart is, is going to be great and good. I don't need to use that because I don't like that at all. Okay. And this one is so happy together. I actually love, love um, this collection. Um, I have a, a few things from Simple Story, so happy together. So I'm glad to get that. This is so easy to use. 
And this is the Say Cheese 4. Oh, the one I just got. Awesome. But she got these in bulk too. So these are great for cut apart. And look how pretty this background is. No wonder you need to have more. Because literally, you will use one here and the other one over there. You know, on the other side. This one is, I hope I'm not taking too long. But I'm just loving these paper. This one is Shine On by Amy Tangerine. See, I never even heard of this collection either. But see, again, her coloring is so pretty and um, so usable. This is Simple Stories again, and it is the Fall Farmhouse. Yay! I, I, I started to collect a few things, paper here and there, but I don't have the full collection. So this will be a great... I don't have this. This would be a great addition. This is... Oh! autumn splendor i have a few sheet of paper i found on sale at frank garcia studio and i don't have the full collection and i love autumn splendor love 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 can't stand it oh my gosh i have another one <gasps> i don't have this either it's so awesome it's so awesome okay this is bow bunny oh i love these bottle cap thing you know just just take your circle punch and punch these out and use them as embellishment the back is great too but nope i'm gonna use the front this is from a collection called make a splash never heard of it never seen it um this one is kaiser i love kaiser crab oh happy day collection love this side we'll be using this side see kaiser crab normally is a thicker paper i'm surprised this is not as thick it's actually still very nice card stock and then this one is also oh wow look at that gorgeous sky background love it and um my lash kind of loose paper from her from the stuff she buy in bulk sometimes she find at tuesday morning she got a good tuesday morning one time she actually took a road trip across to i think mississippi or whatever with some friends and they went to like five or ten tuesday morning along the way i'm like i was so jealous but like i want to come that was after she did it um i don't know late last week late last year this is simple story heart never heard of that either oh my gosh that's so pretty these these two by two cut apart is gorgeous definitely using the other side this one is the same collection oh, polka knots love 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 this is the four by six. Oh, I love this. Love the cut apart on this. The four by four or four, three by threes? No, four by four. Oh, I'm, thank you so much for sharing all these with me. These three by fours, all these cut, I love cut apart. I mean, you know, you can always find maybe papers to kind of use with it, but these you can't, you know, you can't create. Oh, Summer Farmhouse. Nice. I don't have that full collection yet, but um, I'm picking up papers here and there. And I, oh, I just got one. So these are the two by twos. Very cute. Summer Farmhouse. That's like, I don't have this collection at all. This is going to be great for my husband's album that I'm working on. This one is Chimel. Go now, go. Never heard of that either. Beautiful cut apart on that. Cute little polka dots in the back. And this one is crepe paper. Crap market. Oh, very cute. You know how I'm crazy about polka dots. This is pink paisley color wash. Oh my gosh, I love that too. It's gorgeous. Happy. Oh, and da da da. Simple story. The reset girl. I saw that she had this, but I don't even know what it is. I've never even heard of it. Reset girl. Like, what are you resetting? Okay, Autumn Citrus Bliss from Pink Paisley. Pink, I don't have any, hardly anything. I think I have one thing from Pink pa Paisley, but this is gorgeous. Very, very nice. Thank you so much. And this is Damas Love Wild Card. I just picked up my first Damas Love collection, the Sunshine Boulevard. I think that's what it was called. Um, and then I found uh, Girl Power at uh, joanne that was on clearance so i picked that up like separate papers and stuff but i like them i like Damas love so this is beautiful simple story little princess i don't have this collection but it's super sweet i just got a uh, magical birthday so i maybe that can be used together this is all sparkle city again on chimel 
um, paper. And I don't remember that either from my paper pad. Um, but even if I have it, it'd be great to use. Market Street. Hmm. My Mind's Eye. I love that. <laughs> I saw her um, did a haul, uh, flip through some stuff that she was choosing to make a layout. And she said, oh, arrows, don't care for those. And I'm like, no, no, don't cover up the arrows. I love those. Oh, look at this. Is this like a film projector or something? Or a stove or washing machine? What is this? It's for a collection called Summer Days. I don't have this at all. But guys, what are these? Camera? I guess they're cameras. Gorgeous. <laughs> Cut apart and use. Okay, this is Lucky in Love from my mind's eye. See, she's sending me all the arrows. Thank you, my girl. My, my, my life, life stories. I actually have quite a few in my mind's eye, but none of these because these I'm sure is later since Karen started scrapbooking after way past after I had paused for a while. Pink Paisley, green space, love. Simple story, fall farmhouse, love. And several pieces of that. And that's the end of my happy mail swap with my beautiful friend, Karen. Karen, thank you so much, my friend. I love you and I can't wait to talk to you and I can't wait to post this so you'll see how much I love everything that you sent me. Talk to you real soon. Um, if you like this uh, this video, please click like. A lot of these things you can still buy. So that's why I, I went over the name of them with you. Um, and I don't, you know, I'm not going to put any link or anything like that. But, uh, you know, I'm sure that you see something. That's what I do. I see something on a, on a video and I go on a hunting trip for them. Anyway, this is Rosalie with um, Can't Wait to Plan. And please hit like button above if you, uh, below if you like it or consider subscribing. It's my new, brand new crafting channel and um, I just started last week um, and I'll be doing crafty hauls, process video for um, scrapbooking, planning, card making, and of course craft uh, room organization videos. Um, I'm going to post today the, um, the process that I use or how I did to create Karen's um, birthday gift. So I hope you tune in for that because that's, uh, that's my first ever three-dimensional scrapbook artwork whatever you want to call it um and i was so excited and so happy that she loved it uh, thank you so much for joining me again and uh, we'll see you real soon bye